know me yet. Okay, just one second, I will uh, pass my materials to everybody. Ladies and gentlemen, uh, I'm Slava Gujib and today I'm going to present for your attention uh, the Ukrainian company that hasn't gained the world popularity yet, but it is well known on the Ukrainian market of uh, building materials. While choosing the topic for presentation, first thought was to make it about a um, very popular uh, worldwide uh, known company and corporation, which could be quite easier for me and more familiar for you. Uh, but uh, considering the recent economic changes in the world, especially the crisis, I decided to uh, show an example of Ukrainian company the stages of establishment, development and overcoming a recession in the national um, building industry. Um, so, uh, in my presentation the following will be pointed out. Uh, history of the, of the company, starting from getting its name to uh, recent dates. Uh, the heartbeat of the company, uh, mission, vision and values. Uh, you will be acquainted with products and services. Uh, you will also be informed about strategy and objectives of the company. Uh, I will name a few uh, major partners of the company, which is also one of the key to success. And um, in the end, I will uh, show some uh, financial results just to see the uh, changes uh, during the past few years. Um, so, as Plato said, the beginning is the most important part of the work. Uh, the company was established in 1995 in Zaporizhia and uh, since then it gains um, leadership on the market uh, of building materials in the Ukrainian market. Um, the owner of the company was uh, inspired by the um, history of Mercedes Corporation establishment and also named his firm after his beloved daughter, <laughs> after me. <laughs> so, um, uh, next, uh, the, for the past, uh, past 15 years, the company has managed to uh, gain um, the trust of the clients and uh, the authority of reliable and very stable company. Uh, Sander Wood produces, develops and distributes uh, top quality building materials all over Ukraine. In uh, the 2006, their own production line was launched uh, due to the purchase of a uh, high quality Italian factory uh, in Piccini. So uh, the, tra the own trading mark Gradolit was also created. Um, this trading mark uh, is a um, uh, concrete trading mark. Uh, and um, in 2011 also uh, uh, was a very big improvement. Uh, their own uh, internet shop, first in the Parisia, uh, internet shop of building materials was also launched. Um, and as you, as you can see, the difference uh, between establishment and uh, nowadays uh, was starting from one branch and ten employees, uh, mostly from the family. And uh, now it's uh, around 200 employees, uh, five branches, and it's uh, uh, the biggest um, uh, net uh, company in the region of building materials. Um, mission, vision, and values, as every company has some mission of existence and vision of uh, its future and its success. Uh, Sandra Good is not an exception. So here are listed uh, the main of them, I will read. We are building on three pillars of sustainable development, economy, ecology, and social responsibility. Ecology is listed here because uh, building materials is uh, 
production which may harm uh, the environment, but uh, solar boot makes uh, all possible just to reduce this harm. Uh, our economic goals are to continuously increase and, uh, our earnings through cost leadership and long-term profit-oriented growth. Uh, we strive for a long-term customer relationship based on reliability and integrity. And uh, again, about environment, environmental protection is a matter of priority for our activity. Uh, here are some uh, values of the company. Uh, so um, I will not read them all, I just will say the aim. Um, the aim is uh, to produce uh, durable products uh, which are easy to use and offer an added uh, value to the customers. Because uh, customers of Sunderwood uh, who buy these uh, building materials are um, they use them, these building materials, to produce something new and uh, so they have their, their own customers. Uh, and the aim of Sunder Goods is to give this uh, possibility of an added uh, value. Um, the core activities of Sunder Goods include the production and uh, distribution of cement and aggregates, which are two essential uh, raw materials for producing concrete. Um, the assortment of uh, retail uh, parts uh, makes around uh, 5,000 of uh, products with world names uh, available to the customers. Um, products are represented from different fields of building materials industry. I will uh, read now from the text. Light, heavy and aviated concrete building blocks, pavers, roofing materials, dry building materials, lacquer and paint products, steel goods, sauce timber, building instruments and many other. Uh, ready mix concrete is produced uh, in the plant, as you can see, uh, under computer control, total computer control. This is an employee, will employee of the company and uh, um, control panel of the concrete factory. Uh, and uh, this uh, the product, ready mix product, arrives in the time on time by truck. We have own uh, auto park of trucks uh, to the construction site where the building is uh, in process. The strategy includes a vision of future where Sunderwood is the recognized leader everywhere it does business. Our product services and solutions help our customers succeed. Our distribution system is a competitive advantage. Our business model drives superior results. Um, our people are talented and uh, leave our values in action uh, because Sunderwood uh, makes a very big emphasis on uh, uh, its employees because uh, it's uh, also uh, one of the core uh, elements of uh, success. And uh, our customers will make more money with us than with our competitors. <laughs> this uh, strategy. Um, the objectives. Uh, expansion uh, of the cement business. Uh, cement business uh, was one, uh, it was uh, the first uh, business uh, Sandra Booth started in uh, 1995. So uh, we started from selling uh, cement. Just like distributors, buying from factory and selling to customers. So uh, we still want to succeed in this area. Focus on aggregates and downstream activities. So uh, it's about uh, some extra products which are um, uh, which uh, are also used as building materials and uh, uh, also are produced by Sandra Wood uh, from recent time. Uh, for example, uh, some um, steel products. Uh, and um, uh, sauce timber, it's also aggregate. Enlarge the product range with downstream activities such as ready mixed uh, concrete, concrete pipes, uh, and other concrete products. Purchase new equipment and facilities to launch new products to uh, innovate. And a new line of dry building materials production will have been launched by 2012. Uh, Tundra Wood uh, plans to launch its own production of cement. But st still, we um, produced uh, concrete. Uh, and uh, pre-packaged cement. We receive it from factory and the package in our uh, <laughs> packaging and sell. So this is our uh, main objective. And of course, make the sound profit. Um, I also want to say what, one quote, as Milton Friedman uh, said, the most important single central fact about a free market is that no exchange takes place uh, until both uh, parts benefit. It's about partnership and the importance of partnership in business. Uh, here I just uh, show you um, the major partners of Sandra Wood Company. Uh, of course, Red Elite is a concrete producer, um, own trademark. Uh, 
at Konkeram, which uh, produces uh, some ceramics uh, from Kerr products such as bricks and uh, other. Um, Fagot also ceramic. Uh, Ursa Uralita is the company, this one, uh, company which produces uh, some um, warming product. Oh, it's pretty, I'm sorry, I didn't find this one. Uh, SBK is Lobozhanska Budivelna Keramika, also um, factory uh, located in Kyiv. It's an Ukrainian company which produces uh, one of the larger uh, producers of bricks. Polymine company. Uh, it, uh, they could be our competitors if uh, Sandra Boot uh, was an international company, but uh, we found um, a new way to succeed through uh, partnership with, with this company. We receive uh, some aggregates and cement from this factory, and um, as it is one of the world leaders in uh, its field, uh, our products are also sold very good, and uh, we are good partners. Uh, La Forge and Techno Nicole are uh, also partners in uh, building materials supply. And uh, uh, here are, you can see two charts. Uh, for recent year, years, they are real uh, numbers. Uh, first one is uh, net profit. Uh, you can see the real change in 2009 and uh, growth in 2010. That's the key point. <laughs> Uh, that company survived and uh, still uh, has new strategies of de development. I want to say that a crisis really, um, it, it crashed, but it also helped uh, many businesses, uh, Southern Wood especially, because um, uh, after crisis, uh, managers uh, realized uh, many things and reviewed their strategy uh, of the company and uh, set new goals, new objectives and uh, they changed a lot, so we see uh, very uh, pretty results in the next year. And sales also declined in 2009, um, hope, but it's very good, it's not so much as no profit, uh, but in 2010 we see growth. It's the result of wise management. Um, I also want to say quote, uh, the better work men do is always done under stress and uh, under the, his personal cost. Uh, if you think, uh, it's, it's really a very wise quote because uh, after a crisis many companies uh, who were weak, they just left the business and who were strong, they, in, they only improved in, in many times. <coughs> and um, as a summary, I would say that uh, I can talk about this company hours and hours, about its history, strategy and uh, main activity because it's, it's a <laughs> close topic. And um, I want to end only with two words. It's not how long you've been in business that counts. It's what you've done in that time. Uh, for It's our 15 years. Thank you very much. <laughs> so if you have any questions. Yeah, I'm going to ask you to answer the bell jam. Yes, of course. Okay, uh, actually, uh, I have some questions about that jam. What do you need to add to make the objective smart? Um, I believe the more numbers, more concrete ones. Yeah, they're not measurable. Good. Good yes, yes, I agree. Mm, what else? Uh, maybe there are too small of them. <laughs> So no, no, it's, it's, it's not about the number uh, of objectives, so well, they're not measurable, yeah. so this is one. I have, yes. And one more? Um, maybe there are not and so much. And time bound. Time bound. Ah, only one. <laughs> only one. Um, I can tell uh, by myself, not by the presentation. I didn't include it. I thought about that after printout, so uh, I will tell you now. Uh, that uh, expansion of the cement business is a uh, uh, life, uh, uh, lifelong process because uh, during all of those 15 years, uh, this was the, the, our goal number one, uh, to be number one in the cement uh, sector. So uh, it's not time measured, uh, it's uh, no, a very global it can be time measured because if, what do you mean to become a leader in this business? Well, you include the production or uh, you expand your distribution yeah. network or just see here in new lines right building materials do, it do, means do, 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 do you tend to expand it um, 
as minimum to, to till 2012 because we want to launch our own uh, cement production. And uh, then everything will go just another way because we will not uh, have deal with our suppliers. Well, I think like launching new production lines, I mean, still expansion is just, uh, it's just a word. Mm -hmm. How are you planning to expand it? That would be point. For the next, it's uh, rather for the, for the future decade, for the near future decade. Yeah, so time back is it five years yeah. to launch a new production line or two production lines. Mm -hmm. Well, I don't know actually what to how did crisis affect you? You know, just most companies working in this sector of business suffered great losses. What would your company? Uh, you, you saw the losses in, for example, net profit, yeah? Uh, it affected uh, very much. Uh, for example, from the good side, uh, some of our small competitors just disappeared. Uh, I even don't remember <laughs> some names. Um, but we still have uh, a new one. Is but Azus became stronger. Epicenter really. came in the region just in recent time. And um, we also uh, built our strategy on uh, making um, like a friendship, a partnership with our possible competitors. Uh, so we uh, signed a contract and we were the only and exclusive dealer of uh, Epicenter in Zaporozhye and, um, and Nova Linie as well. Uh, Epicenter came uh, right after the crisis. Um, I don't know their strategy, but it was very um, visible, it was very <laughs> feelable. Yeah, no, uh, because of the was in Kiev actually. Yeah. 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 So we are talking mostly about the provision. Yes, yes. And of course, um, as uh, our business is uh, partly um, season, seasonable, because uh, people build and buy build materials uh, mostly in uh, uh, this is spring and summer, yes. so in winter we have uh, some decline. Uh, in 2009, uh, a lot of a lot of uh, uh, building uh, places and building sites just stopped their uh, process of building because many uh, there were many orders on building uh, new quarters and uh, houses, yes, and uh, it, everything stopped just. Um, at one point and no orders were at all. Um, so we just <laughs> were sitting and uh, revising our strategy more and more. Yes. Okay. Thank you.